Jimmy J Rock is here. It is time for the great one, the YouTube People's Chat. To do another Try Not To Lab Challenge. We are back with another Justin Whitehead Super Nanny Try Not To Lab Challenge. Can Justin Whitehead break the great one? I J Rock has come back. What is happening in, 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 in with the millions? And millions of J-Rock fans from all over the world. Baby, that's right, J-Rock is here. Man, we're about to check out this uh, Justin Whitehead Super Nanny Try Not To Lab Challenge. Uh, this video only has part one, couldn't find part two. Anybody knows this episode and there's a part two to it, send me the link, drop it in the comments below. But you know what the deal is. If you break, you gotta type below where you lost and why you don't. You gotta type that the smack was laid down. Also, share this video on your favorite social media platform. Drop a link in the comments on where you shared it and you'll get a thumbs up and shout out from the great one himself. All right, make sure you lay it L smack it down on that subscribe button. If you enjoy the content, give it a thumbs up as well. Hit that super thanks button for me as well. J-Rock would appreciate that, all right? We ain't not gonna waste some more time, baby. J-Rock says this, Justin Whitehead, ja, bring it. See if you want this ass whooping you're gonna get. Bullshit. So I'm here to help eliminate the tantrums and to work out exactly how I can help this family. Quit bargaining with their ass. I'm Dom. You're damn right, right you're Dom. I'm in Collegeville, Pennsylvania. With our three kids. I am a high school counselor. And How the I'm fuck you a counselor? You can't even operate your own damn house. I was DJing and she was the photographer. I asked him to watch my camera bag. And I did. <laughs> and I got her card and I knew that she was the one. We've been married for 10 years now. Dom is my best friend. I'm waiting but for like, ah, Don't give up. Are y'all met? Dominic has all these wonderful qualities, but sometimes he will instigate. Mm -hmm. Rosario definitely has a lot of stats. And she'll have a lot of ass whoopings, too. Giuseppe is our youngest. He's a little class clown, but he can have a little temper. And he'll have a little ass whooping. Meal times are difficult. You won't leave your ass on that fucking table till you do. They don't want it, then they're not gonna eat it. What the fuck? The challenge is play that crap. You better eat what you get or you don't eat. Their menu is really limited. Try it, sell it. Don't you throw up on you? If they don't want it, then they're not gonna eat it. You wanna have your ass whooped. The challenge is we don't have the time to make a nice meal. I picked them up from school. What kind of bitch ass hard. shit is this here? It's hard to get everything done. You're working, you're exhausted, and there's just not enough. Oh, time god damn. Time. Here she go fucking crying. It's hard for us to be firm. And to really Sh shut your uh, bitch ass mouth. It ain't hard to be no fucking firm. That's your damn problem now. I'd be goddamn. Now, before it's too late. Stop me. We hit their ass. Yeah. Oh, stop hitting you, bitch. You know, buddy, Joe's coming for the first time, and I'm feeling kind of nervous. You ought to be embarrassed. That's what your ass get. And I'll come over there and put another goddamn knot on your head for being on the back of my goddamn sofa. Don't pick him up. Okay. 
That's why he acting like a little bitch now. Four years old, you carry him like that. Yeah, you can't be <laughs> carrying a four-year-old around like that. You walking. Do right. oh, my damn dope. You know, kids don't ain't allowed to. He already done pissed me off. Man, I know I need me a new fucking profession here. Yeah. Ain't no damn choice. You get what the fuck I put on that table. Not to making no damn hot dog and no fucking pizza. What the fuck? You get what I put on this damn table. I ain't bargaining with no damn kid. Fuck the Oreo. See, it's the damn problem here. And his behavior is, is very regressive. It's so immature for a four year old. He'll get a ass with one wait a minute. So it's definitely taught behavior and it's been encouraged. Because when he behaves that way, he gets what he wants. You want me to feed you? Why? How old are you? So you're feeding me that we normally do? No. Not always. No, not always. No, so, yes. I feed your ass, all right. A goddamn belt. Whining, yep. they get the opposite. Don't I want to hear that shit? You get your punk ass up there and get a belt. I got a philosophy for you. Poop your ass till you do it the fuck I say. You ain't gonna fucking stress me out. Look at his little bad ass. I pick that damn same track up and go across the back of his fucking head. Go to a chair. You must gonna lay him across and whoop his ass. Boy, I tell you the goddamn truth. You don't need no damn timer. You know, they're kind of going through some of the steps and really not explaining anything. See, see, that's that's why they're doing what the fuck they doing now. Because of this little puss ass shit you doing. Stop is just playing with him. Which is giving Giuseppe mixed messages. I don't even know if Giuseppe really understood what that was. You give me 30 fucking minutes, you won't even know these damn kids no more. I need to see Justin on one of these episodes. Oh my God, I would, I would lose my, I'd be laughing so hard. Just like, how'd you play the game? Just like, Don't you hear that fucking lady talking at you, boy? No, you get up and go over there and take one of them little blue things off and go across his goddamn head. That's what you do. He the first one I'll snatch a damn knot in. He the man. The maturity I would typically expect from a child his age. It's because he so fucking. I think we're going to need to work on. Retarded. Talk to you in the other room. Sure. Great. Thank you. Just here. So he not laying his ass on the floor. I think you need the most help. Giuseppe, he's not listening. I have to repeat, repeat. Giuseppe, Giuseppe. That's your damn problem right now. Say that shit one time. Next time, sign language. With your goddamn back hand. I guess that's why I give in to them 
going so fast. Yeah. I mean, it's hard, you know, being a working mom. It's, it's a struggle. Oh, you know, shit the fuck up. Trying to get certain places at a certain time. Oh, Sorry. God, he's going to damn tears. Cry me a fucking you river. Full time, you work full time. Yes. So you feel like you're on the production line with getting things in all during ready for the next day. I mean, we come home, we eat dinner, get no work done, and then go to bed. It's That's what you do when you're a damn parent, lady. The hell you crying about? It's hard. It's hard getting and then when I'm not. You need your ass whooped too. I'm like, I can't do this now, guys. Like, I be damn. You know, just give me what they want, like, which I shouldn't do, and I know that as a parent, I shouldn't just give in and say, you can have this toy, you can have this toy. You can have an ass whooping. That's what they they can have. Clearly, Angela's feeling some guilt about being a working mum and concerned about how her kids... You ought to be embarrassed and have somebody have to come in your fucking residence and tell you how to deal with your kids. I don't think she'd be so worried about enforcing the boundaries with them. You think I'm Indiana Jones where I come in there swinging a damn whip? Dinner's ready. We're going to try meatballs and spaghetti tonight, okay? And you can have you cheese. You done had a damn hot dog earlier. Take a bite. It ain't what you want to damn try. See, that's what you get. I went bargain with no damn child. Not damn time. You gonna sit your ass here? You gonna eat this? And you won't get up until that fucking plate is clean? Or I'm gonna go clean cross your damn head with it. was laid down the one when he was talking about on the back of the couch i almost snapped i almost broke on that one i would love j-rock would love to see justin whitehead on one of these episodes as you know the super nanny uh atlanta you know hood nanny whatever you want to call it i know he would ooh we justin would go in there he he wouldn't last five minutes before he started cussing out a child. He wouldn't go, set your Man, I can see it now. I would pay money to see that. I would pay money to see that, but, whew. If anybody got part two to this video and know where I can find it, send it to me, please. I'll do a reaction to it for you, all right? Now, what say you? Where did you break? Timestamp where you lost and why, all right? If you are somehow able to make it through this challenge without breaking, type below the smack lay down post your comments down below let j rock know let's start his reaction to this video no rhyme intended on that line and if you enjoyed the great one's reaction that like button subscribe and share make sure you hit that bell so you can be notified when it is time to be electrified thank you for joining j rock stay tuned for the next video mamba gg and wakanda forever What J. Rock? Jesus. Cookie.